hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel and in this video i am going to help you out with pareto chart so with the introduction of order by function in visual level calculation this has come in power bi updates in july 2025 so they have included order by function in visual level calculation functions so with the help of that you can create a pareto chart in power bi within one minute so you know like before uh, creating a Pareto chart was much difficult but with this approach you can build a Pareto chart within one minute so how you can build the Pareto chart like this in one minute I am going to talk about that so please be with me till the end of this video and surely you can also create a Pareto chart in one minute so let us get started if I tell you about my data model or data so I am just having one simple sales table where I am having some columns and here I have created one measure which is revenue it is nothing but the sum of the revenue column so for that what you have to do I am here selecting a table visual here I am selecting the table visual because in table I can sh uh, clearly see row by row what calculations are getting performed so table is a good visual whenever we want to see in detail how values are getting calculated right so since here I am interested in finding out uh, the products which are generating 80% of the revenue right that's why we create a Pareto chart it is based on the 80-20 rule so I am dragging the product name here and I will drag the revenue from here right so I will here from here I will just increase the font size so for better visibility okay after that what you have to do you have to click on these three dots and new visual calculation and percent of grant total or percent of parent both functions you can use so i'm using percent of parent so it will give you a ready-made template so from field you just need to click on this drop down arrow and from here just cal uh, pick the revenue field collapse also revenue field and in the axis you have to choose rows because you want uh, the calculation from upward to downwards right so what it will do it will calculate the percent of each value out of the grand total i will click on the commit option here and you can clearly see it has calculated the percent value for me right you have to hide this percent of parent from the uh, visual and you can do it from here in the well uh, like well section you just hide it because we do not want this in our visual back to the report again go here and new visual calculation and running sum choose choose this template after that it will give us running sum formula from field you have to pick up the percent of parent because we want the running rate total of percent of parent and after that just put a comma and this one I was talking about that Microsoft has uh, included in the visual level calculation the order by function where we can sort the data so we have to sort total revenue which is a revenue measure by descending order so here I will close uh, the order by function and I will close the running sum function I will commit to the measure again so you can clearly see that it has calculated us the revenue I will go here back to the report and after that I will uh, choose the combo chart from here just resizing it and this running sum I will drag in y axis I will make sure that my data is sorted by revenue in the descending order you please make sure that as well after that I will just turn on the data label but not for revenue just for the running sum okay and you may be asking that this is in the form of decimal so how to convert it into the percentage so for that you have to go here in general section in data format option select your field running sum and from the format select custom formatting and here you just need to give the format code which is 0.00 percent 
so you can clearly see that my pareto chart has been calculated within a minute i know uh, this video is uh, more than one minute but here uh, my goal is to make you understand that's why the video length is more but when you will create it i bet you can create it in less than one minute time so yes guys that's all about this small video if you like this video so please subscribe to my youtube channel and share this video with others and let me know uh, what other topics i want to create so yes, thank you so much everyone again. I will see you next video.